Guys, welcome back to Play Prison. Still in RE4. <laughs> Still in the unsettling music room. Justin forgets that his now max cap is 13. And he is going towards the he church. You probably wouldn't like that if you mentioned that. Just because it's Oh, the yeah, that's true. Room. That's unlucky. I'll need to. Uh, first upgrade I'll get is be, I'll increase the ammo capacity again. Wait, look up. Yes, I knew those three things in here. Ye. You got a spinel. Two spinels and an elegant headdress. Spinel. Oh, creepy guy! And I blow him away. Blah, 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 blah. That was my urge. If I had, if I had the controller, I might have done that. You know, always thought it'd be cool. If I, and this was way, way back in the day when Seth was first kind of playing this on GameCube. Don't forget the nest up here. Like, there's one immediately above your head, back behind you. Yep. Oh, I see it. Damn. It's a frag. And then when you go further Holy up... fuck, what are these birds doing? Look up. <laughs> look up. There. You just passed. Yeah, no, there. I'm just kidding. Around. But, um... Rifle ammo. Oh, but, no. uh, back when Seth was initially playing this, I thought it'd be cool as hell to go to a convention as, like, a set of three. And, like, I would go as, uh, three crows. Bam. Bam. I just, uh, Bam. Man and a woman on your right. Like on your immediate right. Yeah, they come out of that little hut that's around the fence. But uh, I go to the con as uh, Dr. Salvador. Huh. Complete with that big old yellow chainsaw I used to have. You remember? That was Vaguely. sitting on my computer desk. Yeah. It had like the gas thing taken out and shit. Huh. But um, Seth go as Leon Kennedy and Justin go as the merchant. But the thing would be you know those, like, Halloween decorations that are, like, torches? Where the quote-unquote flames are, like, material? Yeah. And it has a fan underneath them? Yeah. We actually, like, build... We get one and we modify it so it's got, like, a blue light inside and a blue material for the flame and put it on, like, a pedestal, like a floor lamp and have Justin just walk to places of the con, uh, set it down, and then just stand there next to it with it running. Nice. So he's constantly got that blue flame. Nice. I just thought that'd be a cool idea. If anything, I just think it'd be fucking awesome to like get the bag over my head and go to a con and stop some Salvador. No, it's just the two of them for right now. There's three guys up at the church when you get up there. I'm we'll almost go, out of those little blue thing. We'll go ahead and ransack that hoot. And unfortunately, there's no bonus if you shoot all the blue medallions. Really? Yeah, you only get the gun when you shoot ten. That's there's like dumb. Fi there's fifteen. You said that's dumb because you're 100 percent completionist. Exactly. It it. it it hurts. Good luck in Middle Gear Solid 5, everybody. It hurts. Ugh. Okay, but you were talking about you had an idea for Episode 7. Oh. And we, like, as of the recording of this... Uh, episode it, 7 has not come out. It has not come out, but we're... Uh, we're I mean, confident it won't before this either. Well, I understand that, but no, I was going to say... Probably really only makes sense to me, but... Uh, what's today? Saturday? Yes. Yesterday was Force Friday. Which was the official store release of Force Awakens merchandise. Like, oh, across, shit. across <laughs> all franchise stores and things like that. Oh, my God. They just, like, vaporized. You pop that nest up there? It's because I popped the guy in the head right as his buddy with the dynamite finally went off. So it's like the bullet went through and killed him, too. <laughs> it's like I went sh shot them all. I can't even keep my hands straight. It's <laughs> <Just> fucking weak. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't, don't go to the church door no, yet. I want to get the thing. Oh, then go, go a little bit further that way. No, beyond it. There we go. But now go beyond the church and start going down that side path. You'll get a, uh, not the immediate, yeah, that, well, you'll get an extra piece of dialogue. Oh, this is extra? Yeah. Leon, have you, have you reached the church yet? Uh, well, yeah. Sort of. Leon, did I mention not to take the scenic route? At any rate, Ashley's probably inside that structure. Rescue her. Hurry! Huh. Huh. And then you can actually continue down here. There's more enemies to kill, more pickups to get, but you cannot go beyond that uh, door at the very end. But missed. Kick. Bye! Those guys will. But, 
Um, Aaron, you were talking about that you had an idea for an episode seven. Yes. I know. Um, from what I've read, it sounds like um, there was just so it, it was so free and open when they came to J.J. Abrams about the idea of doing another Star Wars that they kind of had to do it all from the ground up. You know, like figure out what the story was going to be. Careful, the snake. Keep swinging. Yeah. Get an egg. So I thought it would be pretty neat. Hold on, I guess. I was ignoring about it. He skips over this. Okay. So I thought it would be pretty neat if they just made um, it actually about the story of the creator of, of Star Wars. Like if they made Luke into kind of a proxy for George Lucas. I'm fairly certain there's a comedy that's like that actually. Really? That already exists. Yeah, it's a fucking independent film. It's called George Lucas in Love. I what? It's about George Lucas. It's not exactly like it doesn't take place in the Star Wars universe, but it's George Lucas in college, and like all the people. It really like it sounds almost exactly like you guys' idea for the one with like uh, Tolkien and uh, oh, the other guy. Yeah. It sounds exactly like that. Like really? he has a. Okay. Now, before you go any further, you're going to have to go back to the church to get the treasure. And... You remember what to do? Yee! Yeah, I do. You're going to arc that just right. Oh, go a little bit further out. You can go a little bit further out without scaring him. You can go a little bit further. Like, you can go to the door frame. Yay! Nice! Look at all that shit. Holy crap! Look at all that shit. I mean, it's not a lot, but, like, you get a grenade and a bunch of, like, smaller sums of money. And you can go ahead and raid those sheds while you're here. Like, there's a super fat dude you see in the background with, like, some hot chick laying out in a park with him, feeding him pizza. And, like, his, the, like, his fucking RA in his dorm has, like, a breathing problem. But he's, like, really tall and imposing and wears black. <laughs> and just, like, shit, like, it's, it's pretty cool. But, like, so what were, what were you thinking, Aries? I was thinking, like, you know how, um, Lucas kind of became, uh, somebody who was really just, like, swallowed up by his own success and really and ruined his movie franchise. Yeah, ruined his own movie fr movie franchise. Well, what if what if Luke is, Luke going. kind of became like uh like just ruined the force or like, you know, could, like ruined the integrity of the Jedi? Yeah, like he didn't actually uh succeed as a hero eventually. He be kind of he kind of became swallowed up by his own success and was like and it's another, a backtrack, dude. Can another go You're going to come this way anyway. Oh. You got shit to get behind the church. I know. But I was just like, how far will it let me go? All the way. Oh, you shit. You can skip over all that and not get the stuff. But. Okay. Wow. I'll just come back. Yeah. I didn't know I right. could actually just not even go in the church. Well, you really? can't go in the church right now. You don't have the seal. Oh. Well, then where am I supposed to go then? Go behind the church. Get the green cat's eye for the beer stein. We killed those two people. And then shoot the church bell if you want to, and get three enemies to come out of nowhere. Whoa. And then when you kill them and shoot the church bell again, it rings, three more enemies come out. And you can just sit there and fucking farm enemies if you want to. For no reason at all, this. No reason at all to get more resources. You just do that, since you've already got ten. I mean, why save bullets, right? <laughs> bullets are for squares. Bullets are for bullet squares! Yeah! Reload! Uh, Future Chris, remember this in the best of video, and then like immediately follow Justin's line with like all of his deaths. <laughs> but why? Because it's funny to me. No, it's okay. Future Chris won't do that. He's a cool guy. Future Chris is the best. He's not like past Aaron. Motherfucker <laughs> 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 just sat there like deviously lighting that dynamite. <laughs> Well, he's about to die. <laughs> <laughs> Whew! <laughs> it's the best death. Oh, god damn it. I forgot. I need to go look at the it's, gravestones. No, no, no. It's easy. Man, I'll, I'll go look at the gravestones, though. It's the three runes that actually look like letters.
And all you do is you fucking mash three a bunch until it lights up the wheel, delights it, and then hit four once, and then you get it. Huh. It's easier than trying to figure out that puzzle. Inside it's all the ones that are two graves together. So oh, yeah, the an N's, M. the S's, and the, uh, the V's. Yep. It's the only runes that actually fucking look like letters. Well, still, I, you know. So, I know you mentioned that idea that we had for, well, more so Justin than Seth had, for, uh, that, uh, well, 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 I was trying to get the point of... You should, you should explain that, Justin. For what idea? What? Oh, shit. Wait. No, that, no, no. Just that, keep pressing three. That comedy of uh, a young a young token and a, a young uh, C.S. Lewis. Oh, yeah. The other one was C.S. Lewis. Just keep it yeah, in three. Keep man. it in... Oh, well. Oh, well. Oh, I turned that one off. Great. Fantastic. Okay, cool. I'll just keep doing this, then. Turn them all off, start over, hit nothing but threes until you only have two lit again. And then hit four once. Or you might not have been able to now. Because the only three you need lit up are the uh, S, the M, and the V. So if I hit four, Just no. Just hit three. There we are. Keep hitting three. Or no, hit four this time. And then... Okay. Now hit three. For those of you at home, if you just constantly click three until the whole wheel's lit up, and then you keep hitting three until only two of them are lit, and then hit four once, you'll just automatically get the prize. Because huh. that is the easiest way to just, like, press buttons and get all of them lit up. rather than turn this into the Silent Hill 2 coin puzzle. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out not how to light up the fucking... You gotta de-light that O. One, two, three. I'll try doing it in... I don't know, delight that one, but just delight them all. You'd have to, you gotta delight them all and have S be the final one that it lands on, and then you can do the whole startup thing. And we can always just like fast forward this. Yep. You're really just trying to get the beer stein so you can get a shit ton of money. Three. Light up that S. There you go. Three light up it. Oh shit. But oh, okay, hold up, hold up. I can just back out of this. There you go. Operate. Nice. There we are. Just total reset. Hello. Not much. What's up, bud? Okay. Yeah, yeah, we can come out here and we'll do some play prisons with Smash and. And then we'll go back to your place and watch a movie. What? Okay, I will. Oh, yeah, no problem, dude. Okay. He's gonna hang out and leave in 20 minutes. I fucking fuck it up. Just quit, go back into it, and then just keep pressing three. Just keep pressing three. Try pressing, yeah, try pressing, <clears throat> back out and go back in and try pressing, I know it's like all one number, and then like, 
once you get like all of them lit up and then just two lit up, it's the other number. And they're just like, dude, and it does the last one you need. So yeah, try it with. Yeah, there we go. Try it with four because it's starting with all the ones you don't need. And then you press three once to get the uh, M lit up. Or I'm just remembering this completely wrong and I'm fucking stupid. Wait, why'd you start on three? Oh, shit. <laughs> We're gonna have to have a fast 40 montage, you think I'm who's it? Oh, yeah. I select a coin puzzle all over again. Except in this one, you get something that you can actually fucking use. I wonder what puzzle I'll have to solve in Slender the Arrival. <laughs> With the constant threat of death. Oh, God. Of a man coming for... Just keep doing four. <laughs> four, and then hit three. Bam. So it's all fours and then a three. And you got green cast out. Now just... Now run. We get copyrighted over that. <laughs> it's, it's too close to it. <laughs> I was gonna say you should play. You spin me right round. You know, when, when with the fucking dial. You spin me right round. Why is it slow mo? It's creepy. Why is it? Why is it in creepy slow mo? I will just record Aaron doing that and then put that on. The right right. Actually, yeah, we they get can't copyright. fucking copyright that shit. There no, they can. can't. They why would they want to? <laughs> copyright that shit. Put that in your copyright. Put that in your book. Put that in your butt. Stuff that into your rectum. All right, so yeah, um, running through this door. Running open through. You killed birds. You can go see the merchant. That's what I was gonna do. It's gonna go visit the merchant. Oh, 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 He's oh. a guy who sells you things like bullet. Actually, he doesn't sell you bullets, does he? No. He's got everything but the bullets. That kind of is dumb. Like, no, it's not. It's survival well, horror. That's true. That's true. God. But next thing you're gonna say is like, why isn't it that when you shoot guys in the head with a pistol, they die? I, then I'm going to say it Aaron Bass it and follow it me. with a Metal Gear Solid 5 spoiler. Fuck you. No, no. man. Wait, you know why they don't die in one shot with the pistol to the face? Because they're zombies. Because they're nano machines. <laughs> there you go. God. Now are you okay with it? Yes. Now do you believe it? <laughs> Fine. Nanites, son. You remembered the hidden barrel. Got the gold. There's a ladder up to the roof of this place. Mm -mm, that's the other place. Oh, okay. That's the place you have to double back on after you fight uh, the legend. Jazzus. You walk around the corner, there's an old-fashioned typewriter, and you walk around the corner, and then Jazzus crashed. There's like, a gun you can't get, a rifle, an RPG, and then guns you can't get. <laughs> but that's fine, because those guns all look realistic and new, and those are stupid. Ooh, they got red nines in there. Got some red and a Beretta that you can never get. <laughs> Well done, stranger. I see that this planned dialogue fucking doesn't fucking have spoken words. What are you buying? Fuck yeah, I like this one though. Yeah. Rather the possibility of instant kill headshots, but that's just me. <laughs> Thank you. What are you buying? Why? Can I? Oh, I can't upgrade that. No, they only unlock. They only like like one tier of upgrades every so often. It's not like in New Game Plus what where we can just like it? sit there and upgrade the shit out of new guns we want to try out. Oh, I'll I'll sell him back the Punisher because it's funny. Yeah. He just fucking uh, gives you ten thousand. I'll buy. Plus <laughs> that shit's what you got for. Yeah, spinels. Wait, did it sell that? Yeah. Wait, okay. sell what? Okay, I just... Oh, I, I thought you meant the Spinel. No, you sold like, the Punisher. Oh, I didn't even sell the Spinels. Mm -hmm. Or the Spinels. elegant headdress. Unless you still have it. What what you I can't sell the headdress. It's missing a thing, isn't no, it? No, the elegant headdress. Not the mask. You know, like, sell your Spinel. Is that all? <laughs> yeah, keep going. Thank you. Elegant mask. Okay, that all, that's all you have? Okay, then you already sold the headdress, so you're good. Turn around the dime. Save. Ye. Dear Diary, 
I was walking around this fucking creepy ass place one day, and there was creepy ass shit happening. Also, they're all gonna die. Okay, so as he approaches upon the lake and the swamp, we will have to leave you at this moment and say, we'll see you next time. On Play Prison. Spectacular Play Prison. Bye, guys. Bye.